majority members of parliament have begun what they call a series of actions to demand justice for the Ningu Pram Pram MP, uh, Mr. Sam George, and some Ghanaians who were attacked by some individuals during the by-election at Ayawaso West Wagon. Yes, the minority says it plans to continue until the police bring justice to these persons. But they were speaking to the media when they accompanied the MP for Ningo Pram Pram, Mr. Sam George, to the CID headquarters in Accra to write a statement following the attack on him last Thursday during the by-election. The Criminal Investigation Department, CID, invited the MP for Ningo Pram Pram, Mr. Sam George, to write a statement about the attack on him during the Ayawaso West War gone by election. In solidarity with their colleague MP, the NDC MPs walked from Parliament to the police headquarters. <laughs> Five lawyers were allowed to accompany Mr. Sam George to write his statement. At the same time, at the police headquarters, leadership of the minority in Parliament went to interact with the Director of Operations of the Police Service, DCOP Alex Mensa. Their mission was to find out how far the police had gone with investigations into the violence that occurred during last Thursday's by-election. The Minority Chief Whip, Alhaji Mohamed Muntaka, said Mr. Sam George was not allowed to write his statement at the Ligon Police Station where he lodged a complaint after the assault. He said today's action by the minority sets off a series of actions to protest what they term state-sponsored violence unleashed on some members of the public, including the MP for Ningo Pram Pram. We shall continue to demand concrete action no matter how long and how hard our quest shall be. The minority who present Nana Kufadu, as Commander-in-Chief and Chairman of the National Security Council, fully responsible for the 31st January yeah. uh, 2019 bloodbath, especially when his Minister of State for National Security, Mr. Brian Champon, has publicly admitted that national security under the chairmanship of the President, Akufadu, deployed and supervised the broad daylight barbarism on the very Ghanaian President Akufadu was elected to protect. The minority hereby serve notice that we shall roll out series of further action until a national inquiry is commissioned and until the perpetrators, including the Max Cowers and the bloodthirsty hooligans, are brought to justice. Alhaji Mohamed Muntaka said the minority will never accept Miss Lydia Al Hassan as the legitimate winner of the by election.